What's going on my friend? Dr. Matthew Loop here. Thanks for watching this quick video. I'd like to share with you how to contact Google's local business support. If you're not familiar with what this is, it used to be known as Google Maps, formerly known as Google Places, formerly known as Google Plus Local, and now they call their local business listings Google My Business. So if I were to type in, let's say, Scottsdale Chiropractor, or you type in the name of your city, state abbreviation, and your specialty, whether it's a dentist, attorney, chiropractor, veterinarian, whatever, you're going to see these maps listings. These are the Google local business slash Google My Business listings. And traditionally, you'll see the main website, and if there are any reviews and a link to the Google Plus page. This is the most valuable real estate on Google, period. And if you followed my trainings for a while, you know that I've shown you how to optimize these listings. Sometimes though, there are questions that arise, unfortunately, that Google has not prepared themselves well to deal with and or problems with these listings. So for example, what are the reasons why you might contact Google Local Business Support? Well, maybe some of your reviews have been filtered and you're wondering why they've been filtered. Maybe your Google Plus page is merged with a different account. Maybe you've updated your address and for some odd reason it's not updating the address or it's taking a month or two months or longer. These are all questions that I've received throughout the years and we haven't really had an option. So the easiest way that you can contact Google's local business support is simply just to type in Google local business support. Now you have to be logged into your Google account to uh, to do this. You should have a listing that says support.google.com slash business and the rest of these characters but it will say Google My Business Help. Once you click that link what happens is it takes you to this local support. Now you can of course read and um, uh, view these frequently asked questions and these topics however I'm going to encourage you to go all the way over to the right where you see this contact us text click that and it says call us Monday through Friday 1 a.m. to 5 p.m. PS Pacific Standard Time to help with your local business on Google this is fantastic so obviously you want to click call us so you can call them before we didn't have this option the only people that had this option were those that were Google AdWords advertisers that spent a lot of money Google makes millions and millions of dollars every single month from Google AdWords but for local business support they don't really make too much so they haven't had the support team to be able to handle this so this is a very simple way just go ahead and enter your information so you can talk to a specialist ask them any questions that you have this you will find extremely valuable and hopefully you share those with other friends and colleagues that have a local business that are attorneys chiropractors dentists that have had questions that unfortunately they couldn't get answered I mean, I've had questions about listings getting filtered. You've got duplicate listings here and there, and Google chooses one over the other. Google's ranking one higher than the other. Google has certain local business ranking factors that you need to understand. You can find all those factors and many more if you actually go to my blog, and I'm going to give you this blog link up here. It's dcincome.com slash blog slash the Google local marketing blueprint for chiropractors. This training was originally created for doctors of chiropractic but is applicable to any local small business regardless of whatever business you have because there are certain factors that will rank you high on this whole Google My Business slash Google Plus Local. These factors you need to absolutely know in today's economy that'll help you increase your ranking which will get you more customers from the internet. As I said before this Google My Business section, this Google Plus Local, formerly as it was known as, is the most valuable real estate on Google. So make sure you do listen to this training. And here's the uh, website address in so you can type that in and listen immediately. Now, hopefully you found a lot of value out of this training. If you did, please click the like button that you see below and share it with your friends and colleagues that could use this information to better and make their lives a little bit easier as they go through this internet marketing process for their business. If you have any questions at any time, you can just leave a comment below in the video comments and or if you're watching this from my blog, just share a comment below. I'll be more than happy to answer your questions on how to rank this Google Plus Local or Google My Business listing higher on Google so you can get more traffic and new clients and customers through your door so you can live a more prosperous life. This is Dr. Matthew Loop. Hopefully you're having a wonderful day and I'll talk to you soon.